thank you. Dr. Fang, may I have some tissue samples of the Gigla? Hmm? For research? I will get a saliva sample myself, but a tissue sample from you would be appreciated. Gigla's malt, do they not? Patient privacy. But it's a Gigla! Still, patient. Fine. Well, if it shuts its skin... No. Hey there. Thank you. Thank you.
Howdy. You done with the drill? Nice. <laughs> Barry's already gone ahead to turn off the machine. Can we clear the path with the drill? I'll go fetch the assistant. Break all the boulders here? I'm way impressed. You're nice. Ruin is just a little up ahead. Ready to roll out? The headaches started a little beyond this point. But if Larry's done his job, it should be smooth sailing. Here it goes. Looks like Larry pulled it off. Come on! Hmm. Larry was supposed to have met us here. You don't suppose something happened to him, do you? I have a bad feeling about this. See if there's a way in. Look, there's a bunch of pipes over there. I reckon that's our ticket inside. Everyone, careful now. Nice and slow. Larry? Larry!
Yeah, and he said Xena. That was his wife's name, wasn't it? Come on, no need to let anyone know we're here. Anyhow, we gotta go save Larry's hide. Let's see where this road leads us. Odd weather, all things considered. Well, it's fake. Clouds like that wouldn't just appear out of nowhere in Sandrock. It's got to be simulated weather, perhaps needed for some of the experiments they were doing? Wouldn't rule that out. No, wasn't this place meant to be deep in the ocean? Maybe it was for folks living here, in case they missed being up on the surface. Uh, sometimes these things remain a mystery. Let's press on. The whole fake sky dark room thing is giving me the creeps. Up yonder. That door looks as promising as any. Let's check it out. Did you Giggle Co. official leaflet? Nice! This counts as rare literature. All you did was fill in the form on the console? Cool! Let me get one too! Mm hmm. And. What? It says there are none left! Uh, uh, really? I can just have it? Well, you can have it back whenever you need. I'll just keep it safe for now. Thanks. What a lovely souvenir to remember my first Sandrock adventure by! Huge.
it's got a switch on it. My experience diving has taught me just to flip any switches I see and hope for the best. What's your take? Hmm. You don't suppose it could also have something to do with that weather simulation thing, do you? Well, only one way to find out. Power restoration sequence activated. Power restoration That did the trick. Status. Some of the lights just went on. Another door lit up too. Reckon that's our cue. A dormitory? So these scientists live like students? Cables on the ground. It could lead to something. Sequence activated. Power restoration. Well, my maths right. Sequence A lot of plants, activated. huh? Power restoration. This kind status. of life couldn't exist 100%. like this without something special going on. So this has got to be the right place. Exactly. System. Welcome to Giggle. Whoa! Don't awesome. see anything. Is this your first time down in one of these? Show's only just getting started. Is that so? Well, I'm looking forward to the next act then. 
Yeah, well, path's clear. That's what you're gonna get. Stop here for a sec. Take a breather. Besides, I think it might be about time to talk about the elephant in the room. Oh, yeah. I reckon you're thinking the same thing. Larry lost all that weight, but it just doesn't look good. I was more referring to that elephant. Ah, oh, I see. Well, I stand by what I said. Huh. Tell us how you really feel. But let's keep our eyes on the prize. Looks like two paths are ahead. Let's check that closed door first. It says two separate codes combined into a passcode required to open the administrative door. Ah, oh, so close and yet so far. The algae is right behind this door. Passcode? Oh, shoot. We ain't got a clue. Let's look around. Maybe it's written somewhere around here. things. Are we getting closer to the algae? Only one way to find out. Thank you. 
Hybrid organisms? That basically covers everything. <sighs> I've never really put much thought into all that Church of Light doctrine about how the people of the old world tried to play God. But seeing is believing. Jeez, I'm getting goosebumps. I've heard people talking about it before. But you're saying the Gieglers, the rat folks, the mole people, they're all made here? Maybe not here here, but yeah. Definitely from some old world lab out there. That's true. It's only because of their studies that we've been able to get where we are now. Well, anyhow, we got the codes. Let's go. I hope Larry is okay. Inside. Who are they? Zena, Zena, Bill. 
Why do you deny me so? I am the president now. As the most capable lady in our company, you should be with me. Forget about your former good-for-nothing husband. Gary! How could you say that? Larry lives! He's right there! <laughs> Is he? Well, that won't be for long. You've been holding out on me for way too long, my dear Xena. Always saying Larry will be back. Too bad for you. I am in control now. And Larry, he comes back a traitor, saying nonsense about the Holy Book is false, and the humans in Sandrock are not our enemies. Larry, cousin, it's hard to say this, but you're fired. You can take away his dignity, but you'll always be a better leader than you'll ever be. You're nothing compared to him. Fine. Have it the hard way. I'll have you personally witness the end of my dear cousin for good. In the end, you don't get a choice. You will become mine. Then... Together, we will finally conquer Sandrock. VP, managers, do what you must do. I didn't expect to stumble upon an internal power struggle. Gary, I remember him, but he wasn't always this plump. We've got to hurry! For the sky, Gary. Come and make me, you small fry.
it. Larry, are you okay? Zena. Husband, I'm all right. Well, good thing we got him when we did. Larry, you all right? I am. Thanks to you all, Zena. I'm fine, husband. The president's wife isn't so fragile. Husband, I've been thinking about you every day. That despicable snake Gary kidnapped me. But now you're alive. Oh, Larry. Oh, Zena. <clears throat> so, uh, Nia, we came here on a mission. Ah, uh, right. I'm going to take some algae samples. But these machines look well-preserved. I think we should salvage some of the core components. Might be useful if we want to cultivate this type of algae on our own. Can you help with the salvaging? Thanks. Have you finished? Great. Let's get back and show this to the professor and Mr. Zeke. Hopefully, this is what we're looking for. Hey, Larry. You coming? Huh? Oh. Hmm. I think I'll stay a while, Yak Boy Human. I have to settle things with Gary and the company anyway. I'll come back when I'm done. All right. Suit yourself. You ready to... is quite some adventure. I'm glad Larry found his wife. Is he alright? Yeah, he said he'll be back soon. On the other hand, we got a pretty big payday. We found several types of algae. This is wonderful. I hope it wasn't too much trouble for you. It was fine. Nothing too stressful. Yeah, we all got out pretty unscathed. Even better. I take it you'll need to experiment a bit on the new algae? That's right. Time to prove our hypothesis. This is so exciting. We'll let you know when we get the results. Good or bad. I look forward to it. Thank you for your hard work.
I have good news and great news. Which one do you want first? Uh, now that I think about it, I have to tell it in chronological order or it doesn't make sense. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, over the last few days, we did several soil experiments with the new algae species. And what do you know? We found a type of chlorophyta algae that's not only resistant to saline, but also has a decent water retention. <laughs> it means we'll be able to make a bio crust that works in the outback. The only drawback is the topsoil out there lacks a lot of the nutrients needed for sustainable plant growth. So we'll have to apply fertilizer once in a while. Considering the density of the yakmo droppings around here, I'd say we have an acceptable situation. Right. Now the better news is that Mayor Trudy has already seen the results and decided to fast track the planting of the first plot of the forest. And that's why we're here. We need your help for the preparation work. Why don't you take over this part, Director Chi? Sure thing, Assistant Mia. The old hydroponic incubator that you built for the Little Woods doesn't work well at producing the new algae type because it doesn't have fluid circulation. So I've been assigned to design a new one. After tearing apart the relics you brought back, which was fascinating, I was able to come up with the Hydroponic Cultivator. It has a continuous circulation system to allow for fluid flow and easier chemical adjustments. Here's the diagram. When you're done, please install it in the moisture farm. We set aside space for three hydroponic cultivators, which should be enough to churn out all the algae we need. Mion and the commissioner will make the other two. Thanks! You're the best! Oh, by the way, the mayor also asked me to make an upgrade for the mobile suit so that it's capable of helping with the planting of the forest. I'm currently coming up with some exciting ideas of which I hope you'll help me implement at a later date. From one mobile suit lover to another, I thought you'd want to know.
This is amazing! Mion, Commissioner, thank you for your work. With the hydroponic cultivator working, we should be able to stockpile enough bio-crust for the initial phase of the forest in no time. Then we can start planting. What a time to be alive. I can't wait to see this! Well, I heard the good director was working on something to help us plant. Then we can extend our aim even further. A thousand, ten thousand, whatever we need for a forest. First things first, we'll have to configure these. Right, let's get to it. Thanks, everyone. I'm gonna go dream about trees tonight. <laughs> Me too.
Thank you. 